Hi, this is Julian here to help you out with setting up your new TerraCube phone. First start by removing the case from the phone. Then, use the SIM card key by inserting it into the SIM card tray holder slot on the side of the phone, right above the volume buttons. Punch it in like so, and it should come out for you. Neatly place the SIM card into the SIM card tray. Place the SIM tray back into the phone like so. Okay. So. For the purposes of time, we've already uh, turned on the phone. It's just in sleep mode, but you would normally turn it on with the power button on the right side of the phone. We're going to take it out of sleep mode and we have a hi there message here. Uh, the phone talks to you and it asks you to start. We of course have defaulted it to English. Uh, you can select the drop down box to select whichever language you would like. And uh, we'll go ahead and select start. So I am going to select our Wi-Fi, but I'm not going to show you what that is. <laughs> Put the password in the phone and we're currently waiting for updates. And that's what it's going to do for you as well. So now it, the phone is asking if you want to copy the apps and data from your previous phone. You can definitely do that or you can decide not to. You can start from scratch if you would like. I am going to select next so that I can copy apps from my previous. Okay, so now that I am uh, it's asking me about setting up your data and you can do this by processing the data from your previous Android phone if you have one or you can of course use the Google Backup Cloud if you'd like uh, most people use that and they sign in with their email address I am going to select that you can also uh, select an iPhone if you your previous phone was an iPhone but I'm selecting this. I'm just checking for the info. I'm going to go ahead and enter my email address. So after you enter your password, it's going to ask you about uh, agreeing to the services. So I went on ahead and selected that. Uh, you definitely want to go through that and read the uh, agreement terms and conditions for Google. Uh, before you select the uh, I agree, but I've done that already. So now it's asking to choose a backup to restore and I am going to choose my TerraCube one backup. It's asking me to confirm the old TerraCube one mm -hmm. screen lock. Let's go ahead and do that. All right. I'm going to enter in my screen lock. Eh, let's just go ahead and, for purposes of time, throw it in there. And it's asking me what we want to restore out of the apps and messages uh, and all the device settings. I'm going to select everything because it's all checked here for you. Restore. Yep, so it's uh, Google Services Backup Drive. It wants you to make sure that you uh, have it enabled so it'll back up your phone at all times. So I'm going to choose more. It's already on, so I'm going to choose more. It's uh, asking about using the location and allowing scanning and sending a diagnostic uh, for your usage and data. So we'll go ahead and select more. Uh, 
Yeah, it, same thing, and also installing update, updates uh, and apps. So we're going to accept all of this. Is asking you to uh, set up your fingerprint lock. Of course, you would do that by uh, using the fingerprint sensor on the back of the phone, and you do that several times to get through this process. I'm just going to skip that right now, but you might want to do that. It's a good security for your phone. Here is asking if you want to use a pattern, a pen, a password, or uh, whatever you want it to do to actually secure your phone screen. Okay, I'm just going to select right now, but you can select any of these options. All right. Okay. So now. It's asking about accessing the assistant with your voice. You can actually set that up as well, but of, again, for the purposes of time, we're uh, not going to do that right now, but you can definitely go through that process. I'm going to select dismiss. Anything else? Uh, do we want to set up a few more things? You can do so if you want have other email accounts, you can definitely do that. Uh, change the size of text, uh, the font for your text, things like that. You know, it's kind of asking you basic things. I'm going to select no thanks, but you can you know, select that if you want. Adding finishing touches. And you're all set up.